Good morning, everybody. How are you? You guys still remember this jacket? It was Grandma's. You want to say something to everybody? Say good morning. I don't feel too well. I'm not feeling good. Yeah. Tell them. All right, so we're going to use another crap pot meal. It won't be that long. It'll take about a couple minutes. Um, so here's the ingredients. I've already cooked up the ground beef in the crock pot. And then I'm just going to throw in these macaroni and cheese um, in there. And then let it just basically um, warm up. So it would be about two, three minutes. So here's the crock pot. So we'll get started on that. Cutting the meat up because it's already cooked. So everything's just got to be um, warmed up so that that don't take that long. And just chunk it. Chunk them in there. Just make it into chunks so you can see the meat. Um, that's probably... I've got some more ground beef in the deep freezer. I've got some chicken in the deep freezer. We got a real good deal on it. We basically spent a hundred dollars, but it was worth two hundred dollars of meat that we got. Because it was all basically half pr half price. It was clearanced out. That's the way we shop. So we're going to move over. All right. So then goes the meat. It's already cooked, so we're just basically preheating everything. Because it won't take that long for the noodles. About three minutes. All right. We're going to open up all these. Just dump and go. in the cheese packets and then we're going to add the butter and the water and we'll turn it on. So 
I will come back to you when I'm done uh, with all the noodles. So in goes the whole container. I don't know, maybe a spoonful, maybe two. The butter. Probably good enough. Yeah, I'll add that for now. Check it later. And then in goes the water. Give it a good mix. I say turn it on for about three hours. Check it. And then if you want to add more butter, you can. And, uh, yeah. So I'm going to... So here's what it looks like before got the meat and the macaroni and the butter and the cheese and then I'll come back to you when it is done all right so it's been about an hour um, so here what it looks like um, mac and cheese is still a little bit runny um, the noodles look pretty good so I'm going to, I made another, uh, another crock pot, a couple of crock pots. Um, I am going to, so that it looks, the, the other two crock pots look like, I'm going to add some of that into the macaroni, just because I can. break up the, the ribs. So I got ground beef, ribs, some chili, green beans, corn. And I've got a whole tub of butter in here, a small tub, macaroni and cheese, uh, just a smorgasbord. It's got some taters in here. All right, I think that'll. Yeah, that looks good enough. Put the pot back on there. Let it cook for. A little bit longer. And I'll see you in a little bit. So it's all nice. Let it cook. And I'll see you in a little bit. Peace. Alrighty. So I'm basically making a one pot meal. I know I probably should have done the mac and cheese last but we just started with mac and cheese and then I just decided to throw in the other um, crop pot meal that we had just make one one pot 
here is the crop, crop pot. So, yeah, um, why not? <laughs> I mean, it's all going in the same place anyway, so why not just make a one, one pot meal? So, yeah, um, I just added that, and we'll put this on for a little bit, let it kind of warm up. Um, it's on low. So, and I have been every so often just uh, stirring it around so that it doesn't stick to the bottom. Um, so, yeah, I hope you enjoy, and I'll show you when it's done. Peace. All right, I am going to serve me up some of this amazing crop pot. Again, here it is. It's just a crop pot of a little of everything. Um, so we'll, uh, it's got mac and cheese in it. It's got potatoes in it. It's got ground beef. It's got ribs, green beans, corn. Um, it's just basically a one pot meal um, basically like three crop pots put together so I mean it ends up in the same place anyway down in your stomach so why not put it all together so I'm going to get me a bowl and I am going to ladle it up I uh, put a, about a couple of ladles in there of different stuff. Oh, it's also got, I think, some onion in it. So, again, there's that. And then, yeah, I need to do dishes. There is the pot. So, we're going to let this keep co cooking for a while um, just to keep it hot. And then we're going to eat, eat this gorgeous meal. So, yeah. All right. Now let's eat this wonderful meal. Mmm. basically a one pot meal it's got chili in there onions um, ground beef ribs corn it is so delicious Super good.
if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Turn notifications on. Comment below. Tell your friends. Um, our big goal is 1,000 subscribers. Our monthly goal is 100 subscribers. So let's uh, get that, meet those goals. And who knows what will happen. Um, we are able to go live on on YouTube. So um, there's a few live videos out there, and I will be going live. Well, time of filming, I'll be going live tomorrow. You're probably watching this in February. Um, who knows? There might be a live the next video that you see. Um, I don't know, but since tomorrow, the, um, this is still January, this is like January 5th, I think it is, and um, so, yeah, uh, we'll be going live, because tomorrow is supposed to snow, and so, yeah, if you are not subscribed, hit that subscribe button, turn notifications on, we'll be going live tomorrow and showing you the snow probably playing in it a little bit I don't know we'll see but I, I'm so excited I love the snow and uh, yeah it's really good tell your friends tell your family Tell everyone you meet, and um, I hope you have a wonderful day. I'm going to finish my food. I might get another bowl. I don't know, because this is so good. Um, I hope you try it, and uh, yeah, and until next time, peace out.